Well, Big Jim W. The reason I got my hat, my glasses today, uh, asked me to make a video of how this changed my life. Um, around 14, I started smoking. Uh, 15, I picked up quite a bit, and by 16, I was smoking a full pack a day. By 17, two packs a day. Uh, my early 20s, I could smoke a pack before lunch. I could probably do that today if I still smoke, depending on who I was with. I mean, if I ran around with the right person, I could smoke, 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 without, without paying attention, and so could they. Which adds up. Hell, a pack of cigarettes now costs $6 a pack. What are the advantages of this? Well, got my taste back, smell back, and my breath back. All within a month of using this. It tastes better than a cigarette. I get multiple flavors. Help us adults do like flavors. That's why when you go in a liquor store, there's a whole bunch of flavored alcohol. Maybe we shouldn't flavor alcohol either and just make it bland and nasty. All those flavored drinks we all talk about. I don't know about you, but when I regained my taste, you know, I thought about vaping other flavors other than just tobacco. Now, the FDA wants you to lead, believe that these are bad for you, which is more or less a crock of shit. Everything in this is FDA approved. They use propylene glycol to put medicines in all the time that you inhale. And what nicotine does when you inhale it, they know what it does in a mist. Nicotine inhaler. They know what it does around other people. They pump it into hospitals to clean the air. If you don't want to inhale, an e-cigarettes secondhand vapor don't go to a hospital because you will have the effects of this now you say well it has nicotine in it well you eat ketchup how about potatoes how about peppers yep that has nicotine in it too so maybe they should ban french fries at mcdonald's that they feed your kids with ketchup and my kid too now my kid has been saved by this too he is no longer around secondhand smoke you know what when he gets around a cigarette now he's not used to it and he actually coughs he cannot handle it if i was suddenly not to be able to have this I'd probably fall back on smoking. Which would be bad for me. And bad for him. I'd lose my smell, my taste, and my breath back. Probably die of cancer. And my son would be around sick and smoke. Not by his choice. So. The easier. The truth is, if they opened up the import of these, all the mom and pop gas stations, all the big chains, chains would start carrying these. People would start trying them. This would become obsolete. Nobody would buy them. This is tax free. Now you say, well, what if we put a tax on it? Well, I don't see them having a tobacco syntax on gum and patches and nicotine inhalers. What's the difference in this? 
there are people that have been chewing gum for 10 years. Huh. And there's no age restriction on them. So I mean, you could be 12 years old, walk in, buy nicotine patches and gum. Plus gum, if they say they're pissed off about the flavors in this, why are they putting fruity candy flavors in nicotine gum? Huh. Kind of not thinking their attitude too straight. Plus, that is found more than just in the mall and on the internet. That is found in all stores across America. There you go. You can try to figure out how much money 43 million Americans give the federal government and state government a year in taxes along with the big tobacco settlement that is still being paid that doesn't pays for non-smoking activities while they continually ban you and ban you and ban you for smoking you can smoke this in anywhere non-smokers smoke hell they don't even notice because there's no smell you hold it in for a little bit, they breathe out no vapor. Boy, what's the world coming to? I think it's becoming what it used to be. We used to be able to smoke at McDonald's, smoke in a movie theater, smoke anywhere you damn well pleased. You can do that again with this. You don't have to run outside from family dinners to go smoke. You don't have to leave a movie theater to go smoke. You just take a couple puffs, you're done. Hell, you don't even smoke as much. I mean, hell, you do use this, but you're taking three, four, five hits. You're putting it down for a while. You're not a cigarette hanging out of your mouth. Taking 20 or 50 hits. smart way stupid way smoke anywhere smell taste breath back smoke outside in the cold in the rain banned from everywhere taste good taste like shit which one do you want oh Notice that? Oh, I didn't burn my lips. Oh, I could fall asleep with this in bed. Oh, no fire. Yep, that comes with it too.